They got me, guys. Just going about 85, 90 the whole way home. Them famous red and blue lights. It's all right. Kick home is still going on this weekend. <laughs> What's going on guys? Today is that day. I'm headed back to the great state of Oklahoma. My time here in Frisco has been fun. Uh, opened up here at Stonebriar Center. Have two great employees that are going to hold it down for me while I'm gone. But I'm so excited to be back in Oklahoma City. Kick Oklahoma's this weekend. We got a lot of clean up and packing to do. So, with that being said, got a lot of stuff to do before we get out of here. A lot of packing to do. See y'all on the other side. Guys, if you haven't yet, get to my YouTube. Make sure you subscribe. Make sure you watch these previous videos. If this is the first video you're watching, I need you to subscribe and watch the other videos. Just had an interview couple of days ago in Dallas on why I still wear KD. So make sure y'all go check that out and hit the subscribe button. That way y'all can keep up with what else is going on. Yep, there, everything's packed up. You can see my pickup there from LA at the top, but uh, about to make one more check in here. Um, Stonebriar Center at the Kicklehoma Kiosk. If you ain't swung by here yet, make sure you do. Had somebody with some zebras off the machine. We got some apparel. We got a bunch of crazy stuff going on out here, so make sure you swing by. Um, tell my two employees, Mickey and Amy, what's up? Um, but for now, we're gonna run up on them and see what's up uh, today. Last for all, I'm headed home. This is one of my employees right here, Amy. Y'all respect her. Thank you. Check yourself or she'll wreck yourself. And make sure she's not on the phone. My bad. <laughs> What's going on guys? It's late. It's 1 a.m. I just got back to Oklahoma City. Um, unfortunately, I did get pulled over about 35 minutes away from home. I did buy some scratchers though before we left Texas. So we're going to hope that maybe I made some money here to pay for the ticket. And we're going to call tomorrow and see how much that ticket is. But glad to be back in Oklahoma City. Got a lot of people to see, a lot of stuff to do before I get home on Sunday. I slept amazing in my own bed last night. But it's back to business and we're gonna start business today with this going 80 in a 70. Even though I was going a little bit faster than 80, a little slower than 100, somewhere in between, maybe slower than 90. But anyways, um, so I showed you guys in the previous few clips, I got these lottery tickets in uh, Texas these little scratchers and I was like you know paid seven seven of them for for three bucks 21 bucks you have 13 chances to win on each so I had seven 
times 13. I don't know the math on how many chances I had to win something, but I won nothing. So, we're going to give them a call about this ticket. We're going to try to have some fun with them. Hopefully they answer. He said, you can come to court. I was like, dude, when I flew by you, I knew I, would, I pulled myself over. They don't want this money that bad. But I got some other stuff to do. We'll give them a call in a bit, see if they answer, see if they want this money. So guys, right now we are at the Farmer's Market building. Kick is going down this weekend. So you see they got a concert going on tonight for the last event of the week. They're gonna start prepping for Kick on Sunday. That's 20,000 feet of sneakers, apparel, and more. Again, Oklahoma City, Texas, Kansas, you're gonna wanna be here. So be here, don't miss out. We'll see y'all then, on to the next meeting, let's get it. guys so first off want to begin by thanking uh, Casey and Chance for telling me about this spot I just made a new pickup a new cop um, so um, you'll be able to now tell once I tell you that the quality has changed uh, on this video um, I picked up the Rebel EOS T7i. Uh, I went into camera with near focus with that had the autofocus, so this would definitely help out um, me not having that. So I had the T3i, now I have the T7i. Basically, the T3i released in 2000 and for 2011, right? February of 2011. To put that in retrospect, the iPhone 4 was out. It's crazy, right? So now we have the iPhone 7 and we have the T7i. So quality should be better. I'm also interested, uh, you know, how my pictures are gonna look a little better as well. So definitely, um, I like this. Like I said, it has the autofocus so I can change um, different point of views on the same clip without having to, you know, manually mess with the uh, focus, so. photos you want and then yeah we still have the fiery ones and then the USA flag ones. It's a video for everybody asking this is Kate. She does all of our designing and all of our shirts. So yep. over at Letter and Express if you ever need anything. So as you can see I'm rocking the orange and the blue today. Um, going to the Paul George introduction introductory press conference. Uh, today so I had to rock that orange and blue today so we'll try to get some footage of that it might be iPhone um, obviously not gonna take this huge camera in there but definitely gonna try to get something off of the iPhone
so we'll follow up earlier um still need to contact them for my ticket so we can see how much that is so let's try to give them a call again Office, this is Katie. Yes, Katie, I have a ticket um, that I got last night. I was trying to see how much it is. If you just got it last night, I probably don't have it yet. What was it for? Speeding. Do you know what he wrote you for? As far as... The like how much over? It was 80 and a 70. 80 and a 70 is 155. 155? And so I just need to wait a couple days and then I can call and pay that over the phone? Yeah, I would just call back um, probably Monday because I'll be out of the office on Friday, so just call Monday. Okay, um, what type of payments do y'all take? Do y'all take PayPal? Um, no, I can do debit and credit card over the phone or um, check or money order or cash in person. Check, money, order, or cash in person. Okay, I was just trying to... Uh, just trying to figure it out. All right, I appreciate your help. Uh-huh. Bye. She said they take cash in person. $155 in quarters? That'd be kind of funny. Might just have to do it. But yeah, 155 bucks. 155. Don't speed when you drive. Been a long last few hours. About to make this last stop. This person right here. Uh, well, of course, we just left the Paul George. Um, little introductory thing. It was it was cool. You know, they just asked him a couple of questions. What he thought about Oklahoma City so far. For you guys that don't know, these Oklahoma City Thunder fans are like hands down the best fans. Probably of any sports team. Like Paul George pulled up to the airport at like 1:30 yesterday which would have been a Wednesday Tuesday which would have been a Tuesday um, and there was like I said 1 30 there was about probably at least 400 500 people at the airport when it was about 90 to 95 degrees just to welcome him to Oklahoma City um, so you know hopefully you know we can get him to stay around after this year um, hopefully you know he makes things easier on Russ you know like I said he's a knockdown shooter so if they can't collapse on Russ or, you know, they do collapse, he can make something happen. Um, but like I said now, about to go see my Brooklyn. She's been counting down the minutes for the last, she's been counting down the hours for the last couple of days now, about a week. Um, and then today she texts me to count down the hours, so. About to go over there. I know she's missed me. Hopefully she's learned how to cook while I've been gone the last 30 days. 45 days um, so she can cook something up but man it's been a long day appreciate the support everybody um, by the time you see this it's, it's time to get ready for Oklahoma this weekend it's gonna be wild it's gonna be crazy gonna be a lot of people out there just got off the phone with another one of the food trucks um, everything's it's, it's gonna be crazy get there early because you don't want to miss out on some steals I know some people gonna have some steals I know my people coming from Dallas to bomb factory Jojo kicks they're gonna have some heat and some steals I know the people coming from Wichita, Kansas City are going to have some steals. 
Retro Kings, Anonymous Focused, has that dope Brody Westbrook shirt. Get that. I know Group Fly is gonna have some fire. Get that. We're gonna have some uh, new apparel as well. We're gonna have the kickbox out there. We had three winners last show. Easy 750s last show were won. Get on it. Probably two for five. All depending. Be there, guys. Kicklahoma this Sunday, July 16th. You do not want to miss out. And you get to meet this little guy. There's gonna be a lot of people there. Yeah, I think besides that, it's in Oklahoma. It's in Oklahoma. I like white, white bacon. Nah, it's been it's an event that's been going on for a few years. I'm excited to finally have the opportunity to come out and experience it in person, as opposed to just seeing pictures and videos of it. Um, I'm, I'm looking forward to hanging out in OKC for a few hours and saying what up to the local supporter there and, and uh, seeing what the sneaker community is like out there, man. It's gonna be fun.